It feels almost like a lifetime ago since I finished competing. Um, you know, I had the 200 breaststroke on Wednesday and then a few days break before uh, the medley really. Um, but I had, you know, I had a fantastic week and, you know, really delighted with the results. And you know, as a team, we had a, a really strong meet as well. I mean, I think I was probably an outside tip at best. Um, but I mean, this this season has gone has gone exactly to plan for me. Really, um, everything's gone perfectly and. Um, you know the Olympic trials event in March was you know didn't really go to plan for me at all. Um, I think just because of the occasion. I mean I don't think you can really prepare yourself for for an Olympic trials, and I put so much pressure on myself there. I think I kind of just lost perspective a little bit. Um, really didn't swim my best there or what I was capable of. Um, so I think in that respect, yeah. I mean I knew there was some time to drop there. As I said, training had been going really well this season. Um, my in-season uh, competition had been going well, um, so you know I thought I was po capable of posting a time that would be, you know, in or amongst the medals. Um, but that said, I was a little bit surprised to to go to a seven, which was you know a great surprise. I went into the two hundred with some confidence after a strong swim in the hundred. Um, you know, I finished ninth. I just missed out in the final, which was a little bit disappointing, but. You know, the only reason I was disappointed with that is because I had to change my goals after the heat swim because, uh, you know, I posted a pretty big best time. Um, so it's, I mean, it's a lot easier to to go into the 200, my main event, with some confidence and, you know, with the backing of that crowd. But, you know, the heats went well there, which was a which was a best time, and, you know, I knew I had a little bit more to give as well after the semi final. Um, I think the crowd as well really helped on that at last 50, really brought me home. I'm not sure if I really believed I could win that race until about 25 metres to go. Um, I mean, he's he's a fantastic swimmer. He's the overwhelming favourite coming into coming into the event. Um, he's been challenging that world record all year. Um, I mean, he's double world champion as well. So, um, you know, I'm, I'm delighted I managed to run him so close. Um, and I guess it gives me a lot of confidence for for the coming seasons that you know I still believe that there's room for improvement and um, I think I'll change my goals now and you know getting that world record now becomes becomes a realistic target. I mean getting so close to that was fantastic, but you know I, I look at it as a silver one rather than a gold loss definitely. Um, it's just a fantastic week and uh, you know I was delighted to be able to produce my best form.